my channel and in this tutorial I am going to tell you how to use PHP mailer to send emails okay so first step you need to uh, download the PHP mailer script so just search on the PHP mailer and uh, it will redirect you on github page and in github page you can see the branch here so just click on 5.2 stable version later on if you uh, check uh, there's another stable version you can click on that okay so you need to clone on or download okay so download the zip file and after downloading this is the first step and uh, after that uh, we need to uh, create a directory on your host okay so here on public html let me create a new folder php mailer okay and php mailer and in php mailer you need to upload that downloaded file okay so just upload that and after uploading just go back on that and then extract hit uh, reload button and if you after reloading you can see there another directory is created so just select all and then move the file to our csv mailer folder and you can see all the files moved here this you can delete that one and also you can delete this folder yes so on php mailer you can see all the files are here and the third step will be to create a file send mail dot php okay and in send mail dot php just click to edit and if you see here on the documentation of php mailer just go down here the sample example okay so just copy this one yes and paste it on send mail dot php file okay just save this one <coughs> sorry and the fourth is the ability to create an email account okay you can use uh, gmail account also and other email provider so i am to i am here going to create an email account with our domain okay so here just create a account info at the rate vision order dot in here if there's uh, multiple domain then you can select the domain to create that uh, domain associated email okay so let me create a password okay let me paste here okay um, and and you can set this to unlimited also and retype password just copy paste and create account okay yes the account is created okay so access webmail and after clicking on that you can select the uh, webmail application okay let me select the anyone for this and opening that email address and uh, when you click on the access email you can see here the settings okay mail client manual setting here the all the information with port and uh, a server host okay so
when you open your uh, email uh, with the configuration setting you can see here the mail client menu setting for the SSL okay and also for the non SSL okay non SSL so we need to uh, just copy the uh, these credentials and uh, paste in our send mail dot php okay we will uh, set the secure ssl tls com, uh, connection okay so here the email address will be info at the rate user mode dot in okay so here the username will be info at the and the password we have here okay and here we will use the tls connection first and with the port 587 okay you can see here with the tls uh, the port will be 587 and for the ssl the port will be 465 okay so let's change that to ssl also and the port will be 5 four six four six and five four six and five and the host will be our mail dot visit dot in okay host will be visit dot in okay so here the here all the information filled and from uh, we can set info at the red user model dot in user motor okay and uh, add address uh, means to whom we need to send the email okay let's uh, set to my web host guru at the rate gmail dot com and here you can set the name also the host host guru okay and here you can set the multiple uh, two address also so i'm not going to add that and reply to in reply to set the my web host and here reply okay and we don't need here at bcc and cc okay and also don't need the attachment okay you can set that att attachment uh, if you need okay so let's uh, keep these things as it is and just save and also you can see here uh, we can we need to give the correct path okay so here uh, we have php mailer okay uh, php mailer slash and php mailer autoload dot php php mailer autoload dot php so just save this one and everything look uh, seems looking clear so just uncomment this one also so this will show you the all the process so just save and here just check the script visualmodia dot in slash send mail dot php yes here you can see the connection is open and <coughs> auth login and authentication su succeeded and uh, all the messages sent okay message has been sent so just check on the my web host guru yes you can see the mail is received and this is the HTML in bold okay so if you need you can change the uh, alt body body and subject everything you can customize so this is was the uh, configuration setting and also the mail is going perfectly 
when you can also you change the air connection type TLS and the port will be 587 let's check with this one also okay and just hit refresh yes and also this one is also working with the TLS connection okay and let's check the mail again and here you can see the mail is received and this is the zero mail ago so i hope guys you can add the php mailer in your uh, php application web application and this was quite easy thank you for watching the video